Uh, just a short update on my CNC machine build. I bought this uh, X uh, table made of um, iron, and I've started uh, work on this to to adapt it because this was a dovetail table, so I had to cut the dovetails. They were they were right here. Let them pretty smooth. Use the rough cutter, and you can see the grooves left. I'll just leave it as as that, and no smooth finish, but it's fine. And then uh, I had to uh, cut about 0 0.3 millimeters on of top of of this. Here, as you can see, some marks um, because. Um, that's that's how that's how my project is designed. I have a, a sketch on a computer, so I had to uh, cut uh, on top here. Actually, because I have some nice linear rails from DHK, used of course from eBay, and because. I plan to mount them like this. I had to to make clearance for the ray for the block that it can slide on, on top of this surface. So I had to cut a bit of, of that with a fly cutter. I have a fly cutter made by myself. I'll try to show it. It's a uh, big block of aluminium that I um, rounded out with the I just um, attached it here and used the mill as a primitive um, lathe and then um, I built this little um, cartridge for a small triangular insert so this goes in go it's it's mounted with these screws to the spindle and it works pretty well it has it's a it's a big block so it has some inertia and it keeps the the path it keeps the it it, it makes a, a nice surface so i use that to cut this surface uh, and then I made some precision holes. They are already tapped, and now I have to try and mount the screws and see if it fits. I have a lot of other materials around here for my CNC build. They're hidden around here, sitting for months and months, waiting for some time. Um, I have bunch of other supplies, drivers, stepper drivers and motors, they are packed and a lot of some some meals. I have a big meal meal for I plan to use it to cut the ends of these guys. And yeah I'll Try to keep posting as I progress. Maybe this helps somebody. I don't know. Well, see ya. Bye.